Hey, so we have a question from Quora from a person named Braden Bork in the entrepreneur uh, mindset uh, space. And he asks, how do entrepreneurs get their ideas? How do they know if it's worth a shot? So let's talk about that. Um, I'll speak from my own personal experience. I left college in 2004, graduated from Cal State Northridge, and I said, I want to be an entrepreneur. I want to be a business owner but I did not know how to even get that started. I didn't know anything. I was like, I talked to my parents about it and they're like, well, what do you know how to do? And we're like, nothing. I don't know how to do anything. So fast forward to 2013, I had been in the advertising business, uh, considering I started in 2003 on uh, Universal Music. I've been in the advertising business for a decade. And there was change. And I think the biggest point of advice, there's two points of advice here look for change look for uh, discrepancy look for where people don't have knowledge and where you can have knowledge quicker than other people i think that's a really big point of opportunity and in in some ways it's arbitrage right like you know something that other people don't you can charge them for just you can share them your knowledge or you can use that knowledge and make an even greater profit by doing something that they don't know how to do um and so in advertising in 2013, it was a few years into programmatic, which is using data and automation. Um, I was by no means the first, but I was in the early group of people who had direct experience doing this. And now um, programmatic is a $60 billion business in 2019 in the U.S. So it's about 80, 70, 80 percent of how of how all display ads are turned on in the US. So I mean, it's it's a valuable skill set. And I know it's valuable. Well, number one, because we have a, a thriving business. And number two, um, the employees, the people who have this knowledge, they keep getting promoted very quickly. And they be, and they get and they're they're expensive because they're talented workers. And there's a shortage of people who know how to do this. So um, when you're looking for entrepreneurial ideas, I would say, Number one, look at, look for where you have a, an unfair advantage through your resources or relationships or just luck of the draw, where you can charge for something that most people don't know about. Um, and how do we know if it's worth it? How do we know if it's worth a shot? I mean, so what I was noticing in 2011 and 2012 and into 2013 was that a lot of my time was being spent explaining about this ecosystem, right? Because my job at an agency was we're gonna run programmatic advertising for you. And I would say that, and most people would be like, cool, what's programmatic? Or we don't want programmatic, or whatever. So a lot of my time was spent explaining what it is, how it works, why it's beneficial to publishers, why it's beneficial to advertisers, etc. So I was like, okay, what's the trend analysis here? The trend analysis is, a lot of people are asking about it, a lot of people don't know what it is, a lot of people have misconceptions about what it is, I have a strong grasp. I can take a complex idea and simplify it. So as a result, I'm going to go out and do programmatic advertising for myself. And it wasn't particularly easy. I had to learn a whole slew of things. But as an idea, I said, OK, this is something that's scalable, that's interesting, that's in demand. And I think I have an unfair advantage with my relationships. Incredibly valuable to have these relationships. Um, and I have an unfair advantage in my knowledge. And so um, 2019, we're on the Inc. 500, one of the fastest growing companies in America, 10 employees doing well. And um, it's, uh, it's incredible to see the trust that our clients are putting into us. And I'm honored that our clients are, are giving us that trust and, and trusting us to build their business. And um, it's a lot of fun. And so do what you're, the, other, the other point is do what you're passionate about. No matter what you know how to do, if you don't like it, you're probably not going to be as good at it as something that you are really passionate about. All right.